when I talk in this, can you see the green light go up and down? Test, test, test. Yes. Test. All right. <laughs> it's too cold in the early morning. Okay, baby, thanks. Climb on. Yeah. Hi, guys. My name's Tiffany. I'm one of the finance vendors here at Young Pleasant U Power Sports. We've got uh, you guys in here today to look at one of our little bikes over here, and we'll let you guys go from it from there. We're looking at a Suzuki V-Strom 800DE. Huh. That's a pretty serious adventure bike, right? Well, is that what? What is that considered? Is it considered a a um, adventure? Not really. It's more adventure. Um, I believe it's more adventure over here. Yeah. Okay, more adventure over to Oracle. It's, it's it's made to go comfortably down the highway, and um, so you can ride down to Southern Utah and then go off road with it. And right. this is a you know, the it's really it, is he going to enjoy riding it down I-15 for 200 miles or? Uh, really comparable to your KLRs that we have up front. Oh, like the KLR uh, 650? Yeah. Okay. They're, it's really made for more of a comfortable ride. It mm -hmm. sits, sits you more up. Um, seats a little bit wider. Clearly more comfortable than that. Then your Enduros. Your Enduros are going to give you still the dirt bike seat, which is super thin, which especially wouldn't be very comfortable at like 70 miles an hour. It is an 800cc motor, so it's going to be able to carry you at those highway speeds for very long. So has it got some good structure here if you want to put some uh, panniers on it? And I, I believe it should be. I know we, they do have the adventure model as well. This is just the like base of the... Oh, okay. So they make the an adventure hand. model. Okay. Yeah. So this, it comes with, the only difference is it comes with the saddlebags in the back, mm -hmm. which I believe you could throw on one of these. It should be able to carry you along at like 80 and not just be straight. Especially... That looks like a fun little sportster out there. My name is Isaiah. We're here at Young Power Sports in Pleasant View. Um, you know, we handle all the bikes, but Platinum Test Drive, one of the brand new 800 B Stroms. It's an amazing bike, very nimble. Um, like a unicorn out here, we very rarely get them. It's very hard to get in. You can take out for a test drive on it. See you fill it out. Fill it around some corners. See how it feels for you. It's really squishy. <laughs> yeah, that's really squishy. The face lit up. <laughs> this is yellow. It works with my color palette very well. I understand that. It'll match the gold too. That work. <laughs> I lose some street cred with the kids going up on this versus the Harley. Ah, that's okay. Feel that. Feel I mean, pulling up on a bike in general, you gain more street cred. You know, I've noticed that it's got some pretty good ground clearance, and as long legged as you are, you're pretty comfortable. I mean, it's got a pretty high sea height, doesn't it? Mm -hmm. It's just like your KLRs, where it's, it's a pretty high seat height. They try to do as much ground clearance as possible. Um, and it also is kind of resemblance of the, like, the KLRs, though, where it sits kind of high when you're not sitting on it. But once you like actually sit on it, put some weight on it, it dips down mm -hmm. just to where you're sitting double flat-footed. So it's mm -hmm. a very comfortable ride. So this is 2023 model, brand new, right? Right. Okay. All right, guys, so we're going to test drive this V-Strom, I think it's an 800. This is 800, right? 800, V-Strom 800, new. So we're gonna take it out for a little test drive, do a little motor vlogging, and courtesy of Young's Power Sports here. All right, let's see if I can fit on this bad boy. All right, pretty high seat height. I understand it's a six speed. First, I wanna thank everybody who subscribed to the channel. The hours of viewing our content has really been increasing. We're up to, uh, you know, about 850 subscribers. Things are going quite well. 
And so again, if you enjoy the content, please subscribe to the channel. It really helps us. Give us a, a thumbs up if you like the content and help us do something we love and we think that you love too as it relates to motorcycles, motorcycle camping, motorcycle touring, uh, motorcycle maintenance, garage therapy, all those things that we do here on the channel. If you don't have a particular question about what we're producing in a particular video, take the time to, in the comments, tell me where you're from. You know, we've been getting uh, viewers from around the world and we really, really appreciate that. It's very exciting. All right, let's take it for a little cruise. See how she handles. Got to get used to this clutch on a brand new bike compared to my two Harleys. Cruising along pretty nice. It's it's comfortable. Smooth, smooth engine. Parallel twin, 800cc. You know, I ride those Harley so much, I rarely get a chance to get on a bike like this. So my buddy Chris is uh, really excited about coming out and test riding it. And so I agreed to come along with him and we'd give it a shot, tell him what I think. I think he wants to do mostly uh, highway riding, but occasional off-road. I noticed the tires on this bike are pretty smooth. I understand they also make a um, V-Strom 800 uh, adventure style, which I'm sure comes with some panniers, a few other features. But this is really smooth. I enjoy riding this as a as opposed to riding my Harley all the time. You know, I've got the Street Glide, I've got the, uh, the Limited. I think what I really like about it most is just the lightweight. It feels very smooth, very, very lightweight, very agile. Wow, it accelerates great. I think I went up through the gears pretty quick. I'll have to check that out at the next stoplight, get a chance to uh, go back up through the gears. Wow. I'm just not used to that acceleration on my big V-twin. understand it's got a five gallon tank so I'm sure that'll get you where you're going without having to stop you know Chris has got that Sportster I think he, if he's lucky he can get 90 miles on it before he has to stop and fill up again with that peanut tank I think I'll stop over here, do a quick walk around. Wow, really smooth. I just can't get over it. Street Glide is yellow. This is kind of a yellow and purple. It's like a V-Strom DE 800. Nice, nice bike. All right. Well, let's take it back. Got another friend who wants to give it a shot, give it a ride. Wow, that's fun.
forgot what it was like to ride a, a bike like this when I was a kid. I, that's all I had were dirt bikes. But this isn't really a dirt bike. Wow, this thing accelerates. Strong. Strong bike. It's probably about 75 degrees a day. The sun's out pretty strong. I can feel the heat of the engine on my legs with this, you know, these mid pegs. Puts me much more upright. Now, the Harley's upright, but my feet are out in front of me on the uh, stretched out pegs. I really appreciate Young's Motorsports allowing me to take this thing out for a test drive. And really had a good time today. Looks like I need to pick up my pace and get back into the market for an adventure bike. If I can convince Roxy of it, I would have already had one. fun.